following is an ESG 360 video. I'm here today with Terry McClure, Senior Analyst covering Enterprise File Sync and Share Technologies for ESG. Welcome, Terry. Thank you, John. So, Terry, you mentioned earlier that you expect to see some healthy standalone businesses in the file sync and share space. Um, that said, last year we saw a significant amount of consolidation in we the did. market. Is that something that you expect to see continue in 2016? Yes. I mean, when we started tracking the market back in 2011, we tra what did we have eight vendors in our first report? Yeah, something I think. like that. Those were business focused solutions. Went up from there. And within six months, we were at about 60 we were tracking. Now, the market can't, really can't sustain because, I mean, it even grew from there. It was at well into the hundreds. Um, so we saw some consolidation in 2015. We saw Sooner get acquired by Autotask. We saw um, watchdogs get acquired by BlackBerry, very complementary technology there based on their audiences. And we saw connected data get acquired by iMation, mm -hmm. which, which makes sense. iMation gets to extend their storage ecosystem out to mobile access for those people that are looking for on-prem. So, so uh, the market's been consolidating. There's still an awful lot of vendors out there. Like I said, the standalone business will remain healthy, but I don't think it can support 60 or 70 vendors. So uh, the consolidation is going to continue. Some of it's going to be to support that common content platform that we mm -hmm. talked about, but some of it's just going to be companies that uh, don't have the muscle to, to, to stay in the game with the behemoths like Dropbox and Box. Well, thank you, Terry. This was great, as always. <clears throat> Thanks for sharing your insights with us. Thanks, John. If you'd like to read more of Terry's research, you can visit her blog and her research at ESGglobal.com.